Uh, hi, I'm Marion from St Mark's Spotswood Church and I'm just going to show you around our church congregational garden. We were really lucky because we got a bit of a grant from the Hobsons Bay Council to get us started. So come with me and we'll, I'll show you to it. So these are our little wicking boxes that we've set up. We actually made them for our fate. There's many left over. We had a herb garden going. If you come with me, we've just, um, we have a little children's garden here that we've um, just had two seasons, but it winters we've planted brassicas and summer we've just taken out our tomatoes. Um, it's been a really nice crop. Um, over here, we just have the silver beet and the corn's finished for the season. Um, and I'll just take you down the back to show us the composting system that we've set up. So follow me. With our grant, we got a series bit. If you go to series, they're a great um, way to do composting. They cost about two to two hundred and fifty dollars. Basically, they've got it's got a um, system to get the worm way down the bottom and up the top it's a great bin and um, we're been really um, thankful that transition towns have come up with some really good initiatives and one of which is um, compost mates which we go to the famous blue raincoat and collect their compost each Sunday we get their weekend compost so we've actually got a system going where we've got the series bin and two other bins all of the compost in here is actually from the famous blue raincoat we get our coffee grounds from Cafe Mears in Spotswood. It's part of another Hobson's Bay, Hobson's Transitions, Transitions initiative, and that's been great too. The worms really love the coffee. And we can take you to our other garden if you want to follow us through. This is sort of a bit chaotic at the moment, but it's a great garden. Celery, peppers, eggplants. It has had um, a chook tractor going, which has been terrific. And um, the chooks in here seem pretty happy. We've got a couple of eggs each day. And this is a tomb that's not looking great. But these two garden beds were actually uh, put in for our Burmese community that attends our church. And again, it's sort of between seasons, but that will be having a winter crop in pretty soon. So if you've got any questions, you can just contact Marion from St Mark's Spotswood. Cheers.